Hey guys, it's Ebony. Thank you for clicking on my video. I want to show you this beautiful Clusia Rosia Variegata that I ordered several months ago. It's a really gorgeous plant and it was so full. But if you look closely in the picture, you can see several of the leaves on the floor. Basically, over the past three or four months, many of these leaves have turned black and fallen off. I'm trying to figure out how to save this plant from dying. This is how my plant looked two weeks ago. You can tell a remarkable difference in how full the plant is it's still beautiful it is still growing however many of the leaves have fallen off and died i'm really not sure whether or not this plant had thrips or if it has a fungal infection so i've sprayed it with soapy water and alcohol i also um, purchased a fungus spray from Amazon and sprayed the plant down with that. This is me when I'm spraying the plant down with the fungo nail. And I guess I waited maybe three or four days and I continued to see leaf drop. So I finally decided to take a more drastic approach and just take cuttings from this plant, but only sections that looked a bit more healthy. Okay, so this is, I guess you could say, the finished product of how my plants are looking in there, just sitting in water. And I just used a bonsai pumice mix to um, hold the plants still in these self-watering pots. But I will show you a picture of thrips. It looks like this. And this is how fungus looks on a plant because I'd like you just to see why I have trouble figuring out what the problem is and um, how I'm dealing with it. Okay, guys, thanks for watching this video. I'll be sure to give you an update and take care. Bye.